Welcome to Ari Jam 360 Entertainment News. I'm your host, Electra. For this news feature and more things Ari, download the Ari Jam 360 app for iPhone and Android devices. Follow us on social media. You can also visit arijam.com. In today's stories, Popcorn denies being arrested. Etana and Romaine Virgo added to some best. And Jacure demands respect. Popcorn denies being arrested in St. Martin. The unruly boss has taken to social media to let his fans know that he is not in jail after rumors circulated that he was arrested in St. Martin over the weekend. Popcorn, who performed in that island over the weekend at the massive reggae concert with Barris Hammond, soon saw reports surfacing about him being arrested by the cops. On Monday, Popcorn took to Instagram Live to dismiss the report, and we won't repeat the words he used as he cussed out the rumor mongers and what he had told them to do with their mothers. Itana and Romaine Virgo added to some best lineup. Grammy-nominated reggae singer Itana and Romaine Virgo have been added to the lineup for this year's Reggae Sumpfest without making a big announcement. Reggae Sumpfest instead quietly dropped new artwork last night, which shows the two artists in a frame with other advertised acts. It was announced on the weekend that Taurus Riley had pulled out of the festival owing to contractual obligations not being met by the festival organizers. However, Reggae Sumpfest head honcho Joe Bagdanovich has since been quoted as saying, I don't break contracts. I honor contracts. Itana is continuing her North American tour, and on Friday, she will be at the Onyx Lounge. Meanwhile, Romaine Virgo is set to perform on Saturday at what is called a Mother's Day concert. He's asking his fans to tell him what songs to sing. Reggae Sunfest takes place from July 14 to 20 in Montego Bay, Jamaica. Two wildcards added to festival song competition. In addition to the top 10 finalists at the recently held semi-final concert, the 2019 Jamaica Festival Song Competition will see two additional finalists being added to the lineup as wildcards. A recent official gathering saw the Festival Song finalists being briefed on the terms of the competition, as well as signing a contract with the JCDC stipulating the guidelines of their participation. The two wildcard finalists who were selected by the committee's chairman under the advisement of the committee members are Rob Dierschel, stage name Rob Diesel, and Percival Lord, stage name Dorma. Jackure demands respect. Reggae singer Jackure had a lot to say to newcomers in the reggae music industry, and it's all about R-E-S. P-E-C-T. He made his views known on Instagram Live as he updated fans that he is back in the studio, finishing up a new album. He also made his Grammy intentional clear. He is going for it. In his IG Live, Jakir said he eased up his foot a little bit and some guys started to get bright. He said he heard the throw word songs. He makes it clear he's not upset and he knows the newcomers are not producing authentic reggae songs. He reminds them that they inherited the music that foundation artists struggle for. In his own words, they jumped on the bridge and skipped the line. Okay then, we hope whoever it is intended for gets the point. That's how we wrap up for today. Thank you for watching Ari Jam 360 Entertainment News. For this news feature and more things Ari, download the Ari Jam 360 app for iPhone and Android devices. Follow us on social media. You can also visit arijam.com. See you soon.